right now we are looking at uh, one of the most exciting things, right, in dentistry. I, I would like to take credit for developing the product. Okay. I'm, one, I'm one of the engineers who helped test the product early on. Yes, okay. Certainly. So you're basically the director of this. Uh, I'm the product manager for product manager. Guide Great. So Katie, just tell me, how does it work exactly? Right, just so in brief. It's a dynamic navigation system. We have two cameras that are located in this lamp above the patient's head. Okay. And it's tracking two patterns. So there's a pattern on the patient and there's a pattern on the handpiece. So when you say pattern, we are looking at these, right? Yeah, it's like a QR code of okay. sorts. So basically the concept is just like your GPS system, what you exactly. use in cars and stuff like that? Yeah. Okay, great. All right, so let's start with this. How does it work? Just to make it very simple. Okay, so first I'm gonna measure the length of my drill with this plate. So now that my drill length has been calculated, 33.1 millimeters, I can uh, drill on a tooth location now. So let me go to the correct. So basically what happens is, after doing the cone beam CT, you get the data and feed it into this system, right? Exactly. So the input's going to be a cone beam CT with this X clip in the mouth. Okay. And then the software detects the position of these three metal balls. Okay. And when you import it in, then that merges the patient's anatomy with the virtual world. Okay. So you're going to place this X clip in the patient's mouth on the opposing arch? On the opposing side of the same arch. Of the same arch. Yes, All exactly. Right. So that you have room for manipulation. To move around. To move precisely. around. Precisely. Okay. So what I see on the screen, the X mark right in the middle, so that's where so it's I want indicated. To, exactly. Ah. So I want to the tip of my drill. So is the X snap helps in placing or preparing for an implant site. Am I correct? Exactly. All the way through to implant placement. Right. Now we have the data from the cone beam CT, which has been fed into the system. Right. And the navigation. How does it work? We're looking at circles right in the middle. Right. So this is what we call the, the X point. Mm -hmm. So I want the tip of my drill, which is this blue circle, okay. to be in the middle of my green X. Okay. And that's the center of the implant that I planned ahead of time. All right. Okay? Now the back of my drill you see is this green circle that's moving around. And as I move it around, the angular deviation at the top of the screen okay. is changing. Okay. So as I line them up, that angular deviation becomes very small. So once, once we get in alignment, the, the the possibility of error is something like 0.2 percentage, right? 0 0.2, yeah, two, 220 Wait. microns. So here on the screen, when we are looking at this point over here, mm -hmm. considering that's the drill on top, yeah. the blue area is the channel where the that's exactly that's where exactly that's where you plan to place your implant. So this is your handpiece, mm -hmm. and what do you call this? A go plate. A go plate. Yes. So you place this on the go plate. You need it underneath the cameras. So underneath the camera. Yeah. So you have the depth of the drill. Right, so now you have the length. Uh -huh. Exactly. Uh, it shows you the length. Mm -hmm. And you're ready to go. Yep. All right. There's a model right here. All right. Which spot shall we choose now? We're at 4-3. Four, 4-3, three. Four, three. Yep. okay. Here, now I place this here. And I get the coordinates. Are we good to go? No, so now you're going to need to line up the green with the blue circle. Okay. Beautiful, and now you can start drilling. Okay. Uh, There's the pedal right down there. Uh -huh. It's so easy. You're you guided the all and you're the way. Stop when you get to 12.5. Yeah. yeah the, the sound gives you an indication that you reached there. You've reached your plan. Yeah. yeah first plan. time I went a little to the side, but still the deviation is not much. Yeah. No. Compared to freehand, you're still fantastic. Doing good. Fantastic. It's a great system. Thank you very much. And uh, I think we look.